He's been a godsend for this Atlanta rotation. Four wins. He's making his 11th start, and it's not just the wins, but the innings he is soaking up in rotation for Ryan Snitker. A leader on the field. There's that Sir Mix-a-Lot pitch you were talking about. Peralta way out in front. Young man from Braves country. He's got the ball for Arizona, and that is his line against the Braves a year ago. Glove waggle for Godley, and the pitch is up the middle. Shift that. Freeman with a two-out single. Goldschmidt holds Freeman, and he bounces it that way, and that's going to sneak through for a hit. Freddie's going to go first to third. Atlanta with two hits with two outs. This final weekend before the break. Line drive. Suzuki comes through. It's a 1-0 Atlanta lead. Three consecutive singles. More two-out magic for Atlanta. Rifled toward right center field. That ball won't be cut off. It's up against the fence. And Souza's on his way to second. And an awkward tag of the bag. He's going to stop there. And he'll stand at second with a leadoff double. Close play at second. Again, to your point, Paul, about how similarly these teams were. Did they get him? Oh, yeah. He's out. Yeah, the Braves are going to take a look at this, and I think they did pick off Souza. This is going to be an easy one. Yeah, they picked him off. How about that? On contact, Acuna was running, and a bad throw to first. Goldschmidt at 6-5 bailed him out. And the 0-2 is cut on and missed. And the flip to first is in time for out number two. Second strikeout for Godley. Bouncing ball again to first. Goldschmidt's got that. And Godley pitches around a leadoff double. Let's have a shift on for him, and it's right back up the middle. Dansby's going to go to third. They've got him in a rundown. Dansby will track him down. What a play. And a swing and a miss. Godley's got a couple of strikeouts. Much better command in the third inning. He then re-injured his shoulder. Thought that his baseball career was going to be over. This at bat is over. As Sanchez has back-to-back -back strikeouts. And Camargo didn't get the breaking ball. That's five strikeouts for Godley. He struck out three of the last five Atlanta hitters. Now, early in the count, he'll try and go get it. How about that pitch? A 71 mile an hour lollipop. And Ahmed didn't get it. Chase that one. It's in the dirt. Avila's got to make the peg to first, and he does. And Atlanta cannot cash in that leadoff walk. Big shift on for Alex. The pitch is hammered toward left. That ball's deep. And Acuna is going to watch that one bounce off the base of the wall. Avila's got his head down. He glides into second and is safely there with a double. And now Godley will have a chance to lay down a bunt and get the tying run to third base for the Diamondbacks. One, two. It's dumped into shallow left, and it's going to drop for a game-tying hit. So Jay fought it off, and with two strikes, he singles. Avila scores, and Arizona's tied the game. Tip your cap. As this one's bounced to Freddie. Runners coming home. Double clutch high throw. But the tag apply. Jams him. Freeman with the nice little skip and throw home. One, two pitch. He chased it. And Sanchez continues to frustrate Souza. Arizona got three hits in the inning, but settled for just one run. And Suzuki didn't get it. That ball was in the dirt. The peg to first in time for the second out. Braves have chased that pitch a couple of times tonight. That's the seventh strikeout for Godley. In the flip-flop batting order, we'll check in to play third base. Nick Ahmed. And that one all the way to the backstop. Ricochet to Suzuki, but no chance to throw out the runner at second. Descalso moves up on an extremely wild pitch. 
And a base hit into center. Here comes Descalso around third. Ender drops the ball. And now Ahmed's going to move up to second base, throw off target there. Everybody's safe, and Arizona has the lead. So Winkler comes in, serves up a wild pitch and a run scoring hit. And Arizona's in front for the first time here in game one. The stretch and pitch. Strike three. There's the Tom Hallion we know and love. Big pitch, two out. That's the Dan Winkler we know and love. The pitch is hit toward short. Dansby's got it. Wet baseball. He'll lob it to first in time. And that retires the side. A long, rainy inning. Yoshihisa Hirano, formerly with the Oryx Buffaloes in the Japanese leagues, is on to pitch. Another 3 2 pitch. Acuna doesn't go, and Charlie didn't get it. A swing and a miss. And he's going to do it again. On the first pitch, he's going to roll out. And Hirano preserves a 2 1 Arizona lead as we head to the eighth. But as we said, Paul, you don't often have success trailing Arizona in the last three innings. And this man, Archie Bradley, is another very big reason why. Strike three got him inside corner at 96. As this one's popped behind second, Marte drifts out and makes the catch. And that retires the side. Really looking forward to that, hearing what Chipper has to say. You see Luke Jackson coming in the game with great numbers on the season. Strike three. Strikeout number 11 for the Braves staff. And it all comes down to the bottom of the ninth inning. 2 1 Arizona. It's Boxberger, who has been very good as a closer role this year. He won that job in spring training. The pitch. He chased it in the dirt. Well, the Braves have chased a lot of pitches in this game. That is 10 strikeouts for the Atlanta offense tonight. So now the full count pitch. Swing and a miss. Didn't get a 92 mile an hour fastball. So it's up to Dansby Swanson to keep the game alive for the Braves. And they've just won it. Boxberger strikes out the side. Dansby chased a fastball up and out of the zone. And the Diamondbacks. With a rare one run victory, they do it on the road. And the Diamondbacks, for the moment, pull into a tie with the Dodgers out west. Paul with the Braves lost. They're now a game and a half behind the Phillies. Frustrating night offensively as the Braves go one for nine with runners in scoring position.